and welcome to the Animation Academy in Burbank, California. I made a list of what I consider to be the 10 essential points for succeeding in the animation business. Number one, keep a positive attitude. That is very important. You're working with a lot of people and nobody wants to, you know, be dragged down. Everybody be, wants to be lifted up. So have that kind of attitude. Have a positive lift up kind of spirit and it's going to work well for you. Number two, establish goals for yourself. And this is something that you could do on the long term and this is something that you can do on the short term as well. Okay, for example, when I was trying to break into the business, I maintained a sketchbook and I made it something that I had to do every single day. I had to do at least three pages in my sketchbook, quality stuff, not stuff that I'm just, you know, like punching out real quick that doesn't really have any kind of effort, but quality work. And after those three pages are done, then I can go to sleep. You can do it on a daily basis and you can do it long term. Uh, where do you want to be in a year? Where do you want to be in two years? When do you want to be in five years? What do you want to be in ten years? Number three, do something creative every day. Think of something fun. You know, doodle out a little sketch or write a little poem or just have fun with some, do something creative every day. It's really going to help you out. It's going to lift your spirits and it's something that you have to do professionally anyway. Number four, persevere. Don't give up. If you have embarked upon a creative career, stick with it. Stick with it. Nothing can replace perseverance. Nothing. Nothing. Stick with it and things will happen for you. Number five, number five. Be relentless in your pursuit of excellence, a personal excellence in your work. Absolutely be committed to excelling at whatever it is that you do. Try to do something every single day that's better than the, what you did the previous day. And that's something that you're going to be doing all your life. You never, you don't stay stagnant. You work towards improving yourself for your entire life. You know, your art is just going to you know, just focus on making your art better and better and better. Number six, if you're going to be a professional, you need to stay organized. And don't be scattered all over the place. Get everything together. You know, know where to go for whatever it is that you need. And stay organized with your work. This is a professional skill. I mean, if you're going to be professional, you want to be organized. Sloppiness is your enemy and organization is your friend. When you get your break, and you're working in a studio or a production situation, avoid the politics. Avoid studio politics. Man, people can be sensitive, and you don't want to get involved in studio politics, especially in the animation business. Trust me on that. If you want to make a statement, then do it with your work. Do it with the excellence of your work. Do it with doing outstanding quality work, and let your work do your talking. Now, I want to make a distinction between studio politics and industry politics. Industry politics, fine, absolutely. Get yourself involved. There's a venue for that, especially if you're here in the Los Angeles area. You can always get involved in the union. That's what it's there for. And you can get involved in industry politics and help to make the, the animation uh, world a better place for artists everywhere. Number eight, be prepared for opportunity. Make sure that you're ready when opportunity comes knocking at that door. You want to be in a position to take advantage of that. Make yourself visible. You really want to make sure that your art is seen. So get your work out there. The modern standard for portfolio and demo reel presentations, that's the internet today. That's where your portfolio and your demo reel goes. It's all done through the web now. So make sure that you have a blog that is current. There's all sorts of venues that you can use and they're free. Let people within your social media groups see what it is that you're doing. and Get your art out there. Be visible. Number nine, stay on top of the tech. It's more important than ever before. Technology is, is so interwoven into animation today that it's, you know, you can't separate it from just the way that things are done. Last but certainly not least of these 10 points is number 10 and that is whatever you do you do it with love in your heart you know whatever whatever it is that you're doing always make sure that you're doing it with love in your heart and it's going to serve you well 
Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I hope it's been helpful. If you're aware of somebody who can benefit from viewing this, please feel free to share it with them. Like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and we'll see you next time.